welcome back to another LSPDFR video. Today we're going to be playing with a plugin called Bait Car, and pretty much what it is, it allows us to choose a vehicle of a high-end sort, and place it in an area where vehicle theft is high. So it's probably going to be around around the Strawberry Rancho area. We might try different areas um, and see see how we go with that. Uh, but I'm going to fast forward time just a little bit until uh, it gets a bit darker in the later hours and we'll head over to the spot and then I'll explain the plug-in a bit more but uh, in advance I just want to say thank you for watching the video and I hope you enjoy it. Alright so the first location for tonight is going to be at this service station at Davies. Uh, I just sort of uh, drove around and uh, seen if there was any spots that we could hide out while we leave the vehicle out in the open for someone to uh, carjack and just across the road over there is a little alleyway so we're going to hide in there and um, we're going to wait for somebody to take the bait. Now the way in which it works is uh, it's just like a normal plug-in so once you uh, start LSPDFR up the plug-in will automatically be loaded. Uh, the default for it, uh, well the default button for it, uh, I can't remember what it is but I've chosen to switch mine to F2. Uh, so all you have to do is just open up the menu uh, and it will bring up all the lists of vehicles that you can uh, play around with. Uh, so you've got the Adar, Turismo, Vaker. So they're all high-end vehicles, uh, which you know are pretty expensive and uh, most likely to get carjacked. So we're going to choose... Uh, we'll just choose the Bullet for now, for our first uh, run of the night. As you can see on the map, there's a blue blip. So what we're going to do is we'll wait for the car to be delivered, and then I'll park it in the... Somewhere around in here, maybe next to the pump or something like that, and then we'll hide across the road and wait for someone to take the bait. Alright, so the guys just dropped off the car, uh, so then we're going to jump in. We're going to move it in our position that we want. So I'm going to park it this way because you'll be able, if we leave the headlights on, yeah, actually, I might turn the lights off. I'll leave it there. And then once you've parked in the position you want to park it, you need to uh, drive away. So what we're going to do is we'll park in this alleyway here. Uh, we'll just turn our lights off as well. Make sure that we can still see the vehicle. Like so. So lights are off, uh, we can still see the car from here, so we're just going to sit and wait and see if someone uh, takes the car. Well, it looks like we've got someone walking towards the vehicle now, uh, they're showing a bit of interest. If they do take the vehicle, we're going to uh, chase them straight away. Yeah. yeah, so he's definitely got in. Alright, so let's just... Um, Let's just see what he does. Right, so he's coming past this way. We're going to get our siren on and uh, we're going to just try and pull him over. Now one thing I didn't mention before, oops, one thing I didn't mention before um, is that the vehicle actually comes with a kill switch button uh, which I can press and it will terminate the engine. Uh, but it looks like we don't need to. Uh, so we caught him red handed so we're going to order him out the vehicle. All right. Uh, put your hands out of the car and slowly get out. LSPD! Don't make me shoot you! Ground. All right, looks like he's complied, which is good. So now all we have to do is place him under arrest, and that's going to be our first suspect for tonight. So that was pretty easy. Uh, he managed to take the take the bait, which was good. Um, we're going to run his. I'm just going to run his name. Just make sure there's no uh, warrants out for his arrest, um, which is beside the point because he was caught um, stealing that vehicle. Don't be a dick! Just get in the car! Right, so let's just park up on the footpath so we can get traffic flowing. Um, and then all you have to do is just press the end button and it'll get rid of the... Uh, Vehicle. I don't know why he got out. Wow. Don't tell me it's going to play up again. Come on, 
buddy in the back. What in the fucking world is that? Back. Alright. Alright, so let's run his name through the computer and we'll see what comes back. I think it was easy. Was it easy young? See if he's got any warrants out for his arrest. No, alright, so no active warrants, uh, so he checks out on that, but that's uh, beside the point. He's going to be going to jail tonight uh, for stealing a vehicle, so let's get a prisoner transport out here to pick him up. And once that's all sorted, we'll go and find another spot, and we'll set up a, a different bait car, and we'll see uh, what unfolds there. Alright, so now we're over in uh, Vespucci Canals, uh, but more the Vespucci Beach area. Car theft over here uh, is pretty high. A lot of vehicles tend to get stolen, uh, and there's a lot of high-end vehicles that are around this area as well. So we're going to try our luck here tonight. So just like before, uh, we're going to get a vehicle. This time we're going to choose a, an Adder. Uh, it doesn't really matter which car you choose. Uh, they're all bait cars, and they all are installed with a kill switch like I said before uh, which we can terminate the, the engine uh, and then bring it to a complete stop uh, which will then leave the person in the vehicle unable to drive at all or steer or anything like that um, so hopefully we can get into a chase and we can uh, demonstrate the kill switch Oh, it looks like we got our second suspect for tonight. It's going to be a female this time, I believe. Um, yep, and she's jumping in the vehicle. So let's uh, let's see if we can get her to not stop this time and see if she actually decides to take off. And that way we can test out this um, kill switch. Right, and there you go. So she's taking off. Uh, whoa, and she's all over the place. Um, so we're going to have to terminate this pursuit uh, real quick. Right, so all you got to do is just press the K button. Um, I don't know why she's stopping. Um, like so. And then you can see kill switch has been activated. And so she's totally immobilized. So let's see if she'll get out of the car. Alright, out of the car. Hands up on the floor. Stop! Police! On the ground all the way. Alright, cool. So there you go, our you second suspect of the night. Whoa, oh my god. Wow. Alright, so I've just decided to... Um, wow, I just decided to arrest this chick. And looks like these guys aren't happy. So we're gonna need... Uh, we're gonna need some assistance ASAP. Don't you dare trying to get my gun out. Why won't I let me? On the ground! On the ground! LSPD! Don't make me shoot ya! Well. On the ground. Alright, so he's he's on the ground. Let's see if we can hop after the driver, hopefully she's still took off. This guy's got a weapon. For fuck's sake. Alright, let's get, um, let's get EMS down here. If we can. No, I can't remember how to do that. Doesn't quite matter. Um, looks like the girl took off in the car and we've lost her, unfortunately. Um, was, wasn't what we actually wanted to do, uh, but we got started getting attacked by these random people. So let's get a let's get a coroner down here to uh, clean up the mess. Comes uh, back up now, which is a little bit too late. Um. All right. Well, there we have it. We got interrupted in our arrest and we started getting attacked by, I don't know if they were gangsters, um, I mean these guys look like they were gangsters, um, so, yeah, they had weapons, they started shooting us, so we've taken them down, but unfortunately, 
We have lost the bait car. Oh, we've got the bait car, but we've lost the uh, the girl took off. Um, so we're a bit unlucky there. And there's some more gunshots. Uh, so it looks like we didn't uh, succeed with that one, but never mind. Let's uh, wrap things up here, and we'll go and uh, try out another location. All right, so we're over in Rockford Hills now. Uh, so you guys are well aware that the Rockford Hills area and all this uh, surrounding suburbs are famous for its glitz and glamour and celebrities and all the rich people live around here so there's plenty of uh, vehicles or high-end vehicles uh, that are ready to be stolen uh, so we do find a lot of people uh, up in these areas that aren't from here um, and car theft is pretty high around here so we're going to test our luck um, with the Rockford Hills area. So let's go find a place um, suitable for placing a bait car and we'll see if we can catch someone else out. Alright, so I found this house uh, just up on the hills of Rockford, Rockford Hills, uh, Vinewood Hills, sorry. Uh, it's got the garage door open, so it's a prime uh, opportunity for someone uh, that's sneaking around wanting to uh, jack steal a car um, so what we're going to do is we'll call for another another vehicle uh, this time let's go with a let's go with the cheetah this time um, so once the car is delivered I'm going to back it up and park it in the driveway and then we're just going to um, head down the road around the corner and just um, you know, be out of sight that was pretty quick uh, the cool thing with this plug-in as well um, you can actually get a notification uh, when someone's actually hopped into the vehicle so you don't actually need eyes on the car uh, to see that someone's stealing it you'll get a, a message saying that the car is being stolen so let's park it in this in this garage here uh, then we'll head down around the corner and we'll wait for someone to steal it and hopefully we can get another person Alright, so I just got a notification that someone taking the vehicle and you can see on the on the map the blue blip so we'll be able to follow them by GPS. Uh, let's, let's get in front uh, and see if we can get them pulled over. So it looks like they've pulled over. Uh, they obviously know that they've been caught red-handed. So let's get them out of the car. All right, hands up, out of the car, Police, on the ground. Stop whatever the hell you're doing. On the ground, on the ground. All right, buddy, caught red-handed. Let's see who we got. Chris Chesterfield. All right, mate, come sit in the back. Car. Won't bother checking them. Don't be a dick. Um, just get in the car. Or anything like that. We'll just on their names. Uh, double check um, to see if they got any prize or anything like that. Uh, Chris Chesterfield. Let's do it through the uh, radio. Uh, subject record. Chesterfield. Uh, so, no active warrants on that, which is all good. Uh, let's call for a prisoner transport to pick him up. And uh, we're going to leave the episode there for today. So, something a little bit different uh, than our usual patrol. Um, so, we did three three bait cars tonight. We were successful with, with two, which is pretty cool. Um, you know, that's a pretty good... Um, Pretty good night's work, I guess. Uh, not much going on though with the bait cars. I mean, it's pretty much just set it up, wait for someone to steal it, and then nine times out of ten, the people are going to uh, stop uh, and comply with you because they know that they've been caught red-handed. Uh, but anyways, with that, guys, thanks for watching this video, and I will see you again in a, another LSPDFR video in the future.